But we begin tonight with a growing problem for some families making ends meet in the school supply aisle. The price of the back to school haul expected to top $660 per student this year. That's an 8% boost from a year ago. That cost leading some parents to make some tough decisions. In a recent survey, more than a third of parents say they won't be able to afford all of their kids' school supplies. 42% say they plan to take on debt to buy everything on the list. 7 News reporter Michael Schwartz tonight exploring the local resources available to you to stay on budget this back to school season. State Assemblywoman Karen McMahon's office and the town of Amherst are hosting a back to school supply drive to get all students on the same page. This assembly district, the town of Amherst, literally goes from the city line out to rural areas and with everything in between. So it's not people are not all the same. McMahon says the town of Amherst will distribute the supplies. Back to school supplies have always been expensive and even more so now with the cost of things, just everything generally going up. To get a good idea, I shopped Office Depot to see just how much school supplies would cost for a fourth grader in Buffalo Public Schools, buying the cheapest items available that were on the district's list. The grand total, just more than $72. In those impoverished areas, those areas where I grew up and came from, it can kind of be hard going to school trying to learn if you don't have the proper no equipment and supplies. Mark Talley, whose mom Geraldine was killed in the top smash shooting, is also hosting a back to school supply drive to give back to the children of the community he was raised in. My mother, she always made sure I had my supplies on me, but there were definitely classmates um, in the schools that I went to and in the areas that I grew up in. You can see they didn't have supplies. The drive under Tally's new organization, Agents for Advocacy. I want people to have the knowledge to become a a more of an advocate to stand up for what they believe is right um, and to be able to, to tell their community about this. I don't want them to have to wait till they lose a loved one for them to see, you know. Tally's supply drive will be held on August 28th on Genesee Street in Buffalo. You can find more ways to donate to both drives on WKBW.com. Michael Schwartz, 7 News Buffalo.